Okay. No. I have to deliver this. Is that real? Oh yeah. Well, thank you, Don't come. Is it at home? No. He, he, can Can you wait here for thirty minutes? No, I don't want to wait here. What? I have other things to do. I'm telling. Come to the courthouse. Do you have permission to recording that? You're on private property. No. Come back in 30 minutes. I'm a gorilla in a fucking school. Gonna pull up in a suit, nigga. So, nigga, who the fuck is you? I don't know, nigga. I know, nigga. Pull up on your blocks. We got no, nigga. No, nigga. Run, nigga. Run for the pole, nigga. Some here in Chestnut Hill say pickleball has become a neighborhood nuisance. I wake up, I hear it. I walk down the steps, I hear it. I open the back door to let the dog out, you hear it. One of the hottest recreational sports in the country right now happens to be one of the loudest. Like a pop, 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 and it feels like it's right in our house. Since the pandemic, the courts have become a popular place. The noise issue was at the center of a packed public meeting, some residents demanding changes. Some just want it shut down altogether. We need to stop this immediately. If not, they're planning a lawsuit against the city for breaking its own noise ordinance. Eight, nine months a year, you can't open your windows. Did you ever try and live someplace where you can't open your windows with the racket? That's how loud it is. In Chestnut Hill, Chris O'Connell, Fox 29 News. Big pickleball tournament today. $100,000 grand prize, doubles. I got Alex as my partner, so we might not win, but we're gonna do our best. It's all about having fun. Ain't no way around it no more. I am the greatest. A lot of niggas set on the throne. I am the latest. I am the bravest. Go toe to toe with the giants. I ain't afraid of you niggas. I'll end up fading you niggas. Boy, it's all said and done. This nigga need better son. My Uzi is way to ton. I need me a better gun. In fact, I just might need two. Cause niggas say they the one. And I got something to prove. Forgive me, Lord. Here they come. Blah. We played in the worst division. We might have got top three, though. In third place for the men's 3 division, we have. Like we didn't even get top three. And second place in the men's 3.0 division. Oh, oh shit. Yeah. Yeah. Good job, guys. Good. Good. Good job. We're going to Disneyland. Yeah. Well, it doesn't say second, so we're going to say we won. Yeah. We won our first tournament, first place. Fluke. No. Yeah. Yeah. It's the return of the wild fact. I'm going to Hooters, Hooters event today. We just met these kids and their friend is sick, so I'm gonna go pour water on him, try to make him feel better, because he's sleeping right now. Dude, I'm gonna suck his dick while he's sleeping. Wait, what? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Alright, ready? Leo, 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 International. We're going international, guys. I'm a judge today. Wish me, wish me luck. I've never judged anything before. I'm nervous. Look at my legs. We're also uh, joined by some beautiful judges. We have right here, uh, uh, just immediately, a man who loves hot moms. And we're going to talk more about that. And we'll figure out if he likes cold moms as well. But I want to get ahead of myself. Our final judge is internet sensation, known for his prank and comedy videos, being a Walgreens employee to one of the world's most popular YouTube content creators. Please welcome Danny Duncan. Are you ready? I was a little nervous, nervous coming into this. Yeah. I'm still, still nervous. Yeah. Who will take home $30,000 and be the face of the Hooters brand throughout all of next year? Yeah. 
What's up guys? We're at the barracks today. I'm gonna learn how to skateboard. Where you at? I'm in the front. Where? At the door, fool. Okay, fool. I'm coming, fool. I got a surprise. You ready? Yeah. He can skate this now, and he's not gonna get hurt. Let me demonstrate. Ready? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> ready? Why, where are your shoes? Motherfucker took his shoes off. This has gotta go really fast. What's I think this? I can do it. Yeah, I look pretty good. Really? Yeah. You mean that? That's clean. You mean that? <laughs> Are you for real, bro? Stop. This is the KFC. Kevin did the eating challenge at. We were just passing by, so I was like, we should eat here for old time's sake. Do you think you could do it? How much would I get if I do it? If you finish it, you get 20 bucks. Can I get a chocolate cake? He's chocolate. gonna eat the whole thing. Well, it's delicious. I hope so. 1,800 calories in this cake. Yeah. No way, dude. That's a lot. They warmed it up. Right? You got this, dude. You got this, Kevin. I hate chocolate, I hate sweets, so it's that frosting that was like getting me. <laughs> Kevin, Kevin, are you crying? No. <laughs> Don't cry. Dude. I'm not crying, I swear. Gather around and watch Cake Boy. He's eating a whole cake. Oh yeah. Yeah. That's good. Cool. Yeah, sorry. Kevin, uh, te gusta la verga en la boca. Nasty. <laughs> Oh, dude, slow. Oh, no. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, no. <laughs> he wants paying for her food because she's so nice, you know? For everyone. For everyone. KFC. Free, free. Everybody. This guy, he's a kind guy. Very nice guy. He gets a nice hug and I have to pay for it. I pay for that nice hug, man. I got you, bro. This guy, he's too nice. Oh my god, those are giant bites, dude. I thought warming it up was going to make it better. It's just cold, it's so much better. Slow, slow. Oh, you did it? Yeah. Oh my god. No, no. <laughs> How the fuck did he do it? And then as soon as we like got up and started moving, I was like, dude, it's coming out. I thought this time Kevin was gonna hold it in. I thought he was gonna be good. You're rethinking your life, bro. Dude, it's so, it's like, it's like, I'm so close. I thought, you know, he was gonna make the ride home and not throw up. Bruh, went right to it. Oh my God! <laughs> <laughs> That's why I was crying. <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> I think last time it felt like it just went on longer, like kept like so many different individual pukes. This time was like exorcist. <laughs> oh! <laughs> At that moment, bro, we're going nuts. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh my god. Oh my god. Bro, what the fuck, dude? Oh, that felt so good. Five years later, dude, it's still just as funny. It's amazing. I could not stop laughing. My abs, they hurt so bad. Kevin was puking everywhere and it smelled kind of weird, and the key one was standing right like to the left of me, and I couldn't tell which was worse, the puke or the smell of Kiwan's breath. Oh! 
Oh my god! Oh my gosh, bro! See you guys. Adios. Oh my gosh, dude. I think that was the last of it. I threw up everything. Never throw up. Not a pussy. Pull up in the fucking school. Gonna pull up to the zoo. So, nigga, who the fuck is you? I don't know, nigga. Hey! Ping pong? No? I like your feet. I like his feet. Local spa. I haven't been here in a while. I've been in Florida. This is my mentor. Right here, Sue Min. One of the top. I want to learn. Okay. You yeah, better paddle. Paddle sucks. Dude. I get you one. You drink it, you buy it. Of course. I charge a lesson. Okay. For 240 bucks. For one lesson. No, a lesson. You're not going to get better on with one lesson, brother. How about all? I give you nine points. You beat me, then. We do something about it. Let's but do it. now you cannot. No, no, I'm very good. Uh, not to me. My mom had sex with a professional ping pong player. Who is that? Jim Sing Woo. Look, he's gonna play me with a little paddle. Unreal. Ooh. Honestly, I'm not no cap though. If I had a paddle, I think I could keep it. Paddle sucks dick. No, you have suck with I also suck, but I suck worse with this paddle. <laughs> Where did you bring him? Don't bring him. <laughs> 15 or 15 or 15, 17. Let me finish for you, I need the rest. 15, 18. This guy, bro. Next time you're gonna get a lesson, get the right dress. Right dress.